Hey guys, well, this is just the unboxing of Besiege from Cool Mini or Not, which is a new kind of castle defense, sort of a tower defense type game in which you've got a fortress, a bunch of heroes which are trying to hold out against large groups of monsters that are trying to destroy this castle. Here we have a bunch of Zombie Side Black Plague character cards for the base set heroes and also the expansion heroes. And then we have also Big Pizza Box, Besiege Defenders Box. Inside we've got a bunch of different heroes. These were unlocked during the kickstart that was late last year. All quite nicely detailed. Also have got some various alternate sculpts of the creatures. Towers. Colored bases, the avatar, and the big dragon. Looks pretty cool. Quite neat sculpts, really. Let's see if I can get the camera to focus. That's better. Quite a lot of detail on that guy. If you're wanting to have some ideas as to the colour schemes that are used other than the box art, obviously, you can still check out the Kickstarter to have a look at some of the painted up miniatures. Oh, it's actually hollow on the inside. Interesting. It's quite a neat model, that one. <laughs> And underneath this initial layer, we've got some additional monsters. And some of the damaged towers. Now, I'm not too sure what all these are going to be used for, but I'm assuming they're different tokens to represent things. Oh yeah, that's the food tokens. I'm not too sure how the other ones are used in the game yet, but I'm sure it would all be revealed pretty soon after a few game sessions. Let's put that back in the box. Let's have a look at that in there. And there we've got the character cards. These are the besieged ones. All quite, quite nicely drawn up and detailed. The packaging on this box is quite nice. It's got nice uh, a big open spaces for all of the different parts. And it's also in the new pizza box design, which is much easier to access all of these different things from, which is very cool. Now just be aware while we close this back up.
character card so I'm not too sure what these ones are for uh, don't recognize the characters but they could be some of the Kickstarter ones that were in the Defenders box and it could be wrong but that's what I'd assume that they could be what they are so this is the retail package so Besieged Sons of the Abyss pretty cool artwork yeah. Have a little look at the guy inside. As I was mentioning earlier, uh, it does give you a bit of an idea as to some of the intended color schemes for these guys. It would be really awesome to see some of these painted up uh, in person, which uh, yeah, we'll see what people do with them in various local stores. It could be quite cool. As you can see here, so this is the fortress in which the or the castle in which is getting sieged from these outer lying areas, and the players are trying to defend this for a certain amount of time to get the messengers out and then back. Um, occasionally, the avatar can also spawn, which would give the heroes a much bigger challenge. But in order to more easily combat, they've actually got this big artillery piece in the middle, which can aid them in defending the fortress. So yeah, you can yeah have a look here at the included character cards. And these are the miniatures in which the base set comes with. Now, outside of the Kickstarter, I'm not too sure how you'll get uh, figures for the Avatar and the Dragon, which are sort of the big bosses, which are included in this box set as uh, sort of chip tokens. But uh, we may find out at a later date and also probably when they release more information uh, just as to what they might be doing with some future expansion packs. And just have a last look, see on the bottom side. Yeah, so that's just a quick brief look through of Besiege Sons of Abyss. Hope you enjoyed the video look through. And if you've got the Kickstarter coming, that's a little bit of an idea of what you get in the box. Uh, we won't be opening up this particular set because this one's actually off on its way to Spellbound. Hope you enjoyed the video. And if you've got the game, do enjoy it. If you're planning on getting the game, it looks like it could be a lot of fun especially if you like the tower defense or the castle defense genre, uh, more commonly seen in video games, but we're starting to see some board games adopt that style also, which is pretty cool because it is quite a lot of fun, uh, especially grab some of your mates along and, yeah, enjoy. Okay, have a good day or night, and tune in next time for another unboxing video. Cool. Bye.